Yeah, all right, lads. So today we're going to be reviewing Silver Inform. Kyle Bennett plays for Portsmouth in the Football League 2. He's 5'5 five five tall. He's right footed. He's got a three star weak foot and three star skills. Looking at his in games, he stands out to his 96 balance, 95 agility, 85 sprint speed, 81 acceleration, and 71 dribbling. We have also included all the upgrades over his non inform as a comparison for you. So you can see each individual start upgrade from all of his stats there. So you can always pause it for a close look at any of them if you like. So this is the team we're using him in, a 4-3-3 Football League 1 team with uh, Inform Bennett there at left wing. So now onto the gameplay for you so you can see how he was performing for me. So looking at Inform Bennett's card stats, his only real two standouts is got to be that 84 pace, 75 dribbling. Nothing else really is uh, standing out on his card stats unfortunately. Now pace wise, it's not too bad. Now it's nothing amazing, he's not really really fast. But it is okay to cope enough as a winger. Still managed to beat some players on the outside. Great for cutting in as well. Now his dribbling is only average at best, especially for a silver player. But it is really really helped out with probably the best part of uh, Bennett's game that is his amazing 95 agility and his 96 balance as well so don't sprint too much slow down when you're approaching the defenders uh, throw in some quick changes of direction uh, that is enough to be able to do some damage uh, through the defenders uh, does only have a three star skill not too bad obviously I got the roulette but obviously you would prefer four did manage to win a couple of penalties using that agility well in the box to win the penalties did to comb both of his chances on the penalty spot as well now shooting wise his stats are not that good they're quite poor to be honest but still did manage to get amongst the goals even from left wing which is good for me normally on when i play with the uh, winger formations they do get isolated but still managed to get in get some goals obviously a couple were penalties but he wasn't as bad as I thought he was going to be. Quite surprised that uh, well he was putting the goals away. Not too bad at all. Passing was okay. Did grab a couple of assists. Can't really complain in that department. But he is only a small player. He's only 5'5". Five five and he is a bit on the weak side as well. So he can get dispossessed quite easily. Sometimes if you get isolated on the wing. He gets swamped. He really is going to struggle against those uh, stronger defenders. Which that was really one of my only real problems. I did run into with it in Form Bennett. So let's have a look at Inform Bennett's performance stats. So in seven games, he did manage to bag himself six goals and get two assists. All of his stats information is on the left. All the goal information is on the right there. That position map does show you where his goals were scored and those assists were created as well. So overall, we're going to give Inform Bennett an 8.2 out of 10. Now, he did put in some good performances for us. And 6 in 7 games from the wing, for me, is a really good goal record, in my opinion. Normally, as I said, I do struggle with goals from the wing uh, sometimes. Especially for a, a 69 rated silver player as well. Obviously, he's nothing amazing. He is only average, but he does have some decent stats. He is able to do uh, put in some good performance for you on the pitch. But he is a must-have for a Football League 2 side if you're making one or you've already got one. Or also, obviously, if you're a Pompey fan. Now, his shooting is only average, but we still did manage to get the goals, as you've seen in his stats and the clips. And as we said, only real problem with him was his size and his strength. Tiny player. Average strength, that means spells disaster when you're coming up against the big defenders or you get swamped in the box. Other than that, certainly is a manageable player to use, definitely on that left wing. Highly recommended for those Football League 2 fans. So finally, we're just going to leave you with Inform Bennett's positives and negatives to look at. Now, his current price range is a 50 to 100k on PlayStation, 30 to 70k on Xbox is quite pricey for what he is but if you're a fan of football league 2 or obviously if you're a pompey fan it is worth a shout probably at his lower price band if you get lucky if you can find him quite hard to find obviously it's only because it's the end of 15 not many packs being open not many about but i would say in my opinion he is really only worth probably 15 20 to 25k roughly around that sort of price he is only worth that in my opinion so if you can get him for the lower price band maybe is worth a crack if you've got a football league two team so hopefully you did enjoy this review if you did please smash a like it does help out a lot please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well loads more to check out on that channel loads of squad builders loads of reviews to come obviously we're slacking off a bit with fifa 15 we will be back up to uploads every day once fifa 16 comes out obviously it's just it's getting a struggle to play it lately uh really looking forward to fifa 16 hopefully we can get some great content going there so thanks a lot for watching lads i really do appreciate it cheers lads see you later